So with the hands on the knees, we're gonna do those Sufi grinds, rolled over cage around the pelvic bowl. So even, even this movement, even though it's not directly addressing the, um, the hips and the shoulders, it's still creating movement. It's still creating flow. So it's good to move the entirety of the body. It's good to have these like awarenesses of our hips and shoulders. And we do open them up a lot in our practice. Okay. Um, but we wanna move the entirety of the body. And then as you're ready, reverse your circle. And then coming into the pause is stillness and just notice. Just notice all that is present within you and around you. Mm. All right, we're going to bring the, the right leg out. I'm not going to mirror, so I'm not sure how it appears to you. But we're going to bring the, the right leg out and then just turn to face the left knee. So if the left knee bent out in front, bring the left arm up, inhale, exhale, reach over the leg. Inhale, come up and the arm can move as much as you want. Exhale, come over. So we're getting a nice side stretch. The more we move the arms, you can even like tap the fingers onto the floor behind you and then reach forward. And notice looking up, it's going to shift. If you look down at your leg, it's going to shift the position of your rib cage. So when we're looking up, it's going to be a shorter range of motion. When we're looking down because we're adding a little twist, it's a little different. So you choose what feels right for you. And what I'm doing is I'm going back and forth. So I look up and then I look down. Wherever you're at, we'll do two more. Good, and last one. Good, and then just turn to face forward. Pause, feel the difference between the left and the right. So that's another thing with the continuous movement, especially when we isolate one side and then the other, you can feel the shift, you can feel what has, has changed. So we're gonna to go to the other side, right? So we'll bring that, that foot in, extend that leg out, turn the body so our, our heart is in line with our right knee. Inhale that right arm up, exhale it over. I'm even noticing the hand that's on my leg is just like sliding forward and back. So right about here, this is where my range of motion is starting to increase. Ah. And it might feel a little different on this side. Maybe your range of motion is completely different. And you might be feeling it in other parts of the body. We're getting a nice side stretch here. And we'll do two more. And then coming back up, bring that leg in. Just notice how you feel. Maybe roll the shoulders down 